This is my quick review of Joker number one. It will have spoilers in it. It will also have some conspiracy theories. So uh, be pre-warned. The Joker is written by James Tynan with art by Gilliam March. Let's get the easy stuff out of the way. The art by Gilliam March is excellent. Really, this story shouldn't be called The Joker. This should be called What is Evil? It's not a Joker story. It's a story about a retired Jim Gordon and the damage that the Joker has done to him and his family. Jim is approached by the mysterious Cresta and her bodyguard, but we've met them before. Cresta was just a little girl last time we met her, and now she's all grown up, and I believe we've met her sister too, Isabella, and I believe she's the girl on the table. The punchline backup story is written by Sam Johns and James Tynan, with uh, excellent art by Mirka Aldalfo. The story starts that Punchline is having some problems getting along with others in prison. And Bluebird is sent to investigate Punchline's troubled past. Now for the conspiracy. Now for my belief in where this book is going. I have not read issue 2 or 3. So I do not know. I could be completely wrong. But to me, this book is a shot over the bow. James Tynan is trying to tell us all that I am going to blow you out of the water with not only a Joker book, but a Batman book. Main story and the punchline story are basically two different sides to the same coin. The imagery of the main Joker story is Court of Owls. It is... Uh, killing joke it is bane breaking batman's back three of the most important batman storylines of all times i also did not realize that punchline's first appearance true appearance and how she got her name was in court of owls i guess i was a little slow on the uptake on that one it's hard to say after reading just issue one, but maybe the start of the greatest Joker story ever told. I guess we'll find out better in issue two and three. As Jim goes to Belize, please consider liking, subscribing, and sharing, and leave your comments down below. I'm interested to hear what you have to say about where this book is going.